Okay, so there was another part of the uh, your time in Hollywood where you had like a vision. You were you were in a mountain in Palm Springs. Yes, it was about like the tentacles. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Talk yeah. about that. Yeah. So um, the 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 night before I had lunch with my girlfriend, uh, my sister in Christ, we the we one took making the, whole- the movie. Yeah, about making yeah, the movie. Yeah. She wanted to take us to the mountain, to the Taquita. I always pronounce it wrong. I think it's the Taquita Mountain, somewhere in Palm Springs, forgive me. But we go up there in the mountain, we're praying. And as we're praying, I've never seen this before. Um, I saw um, tentacles, these long, long tentacles. It was kind of like octopus tentacle, but not. I didn't see a suction cup. It was dark green, black. It was really gross. And it was coming out. I heard the Lord say second heaven. So I knew they're coming out of the second heaven. And this tentacle wrapped itself around billboards. Mm. And I was looking at it and I knew that billboards have a spirit attached to it. Mm. And I knew that that second heaven spirit was projecting itself. And I knew it was a spirit of greed, spirit of lust, there's a spirit, right, of, of you know, uh, covetousness, right? What a billboard show. Buy this, buy that, you know, right. have money or, or, or pornography. So mm-hmm. the Lord showed that behind billboards, there are spirits attached to it. So I started praying to break that off. We also, I, I shared it with the group because we were praying. We were all seeing something and, uh, you know, break it forth and, and break it off. But another thing, too, I just had, I had a revelation as well. Celebrities, too, right? Celebrities don't realize that they are, if you're not operating the Holy Ghost, you're operating other spirits, period, end of story. Yeah. So these celebrities that post pictures and videos and lusty stuff, it, there's a spirit attached to it. It's either first of all living inside of them, but also the spirit is just using them to project same thing in billboards. It's also that. And I, and I thought to myself, this last night, I thought to myself, wow, the, the Lord said, protect your eye gates, protect your ear gates. So I'm like, wow, Lord, the enemy is literally everywhere which I know, but yeah. you, know, you don't really even kind of think about it. I said, wow, pr- <laughs> even billboards driving. I'm like, I got to protect my blood of Jesus on my eyes, but uh-huh. praise yeah. yeah. So it was interesting because I had had a similar, I had had a dream that r- reminded me. Cause I think you had, you and I were talking and I I'd, I'd realized I'm like, Oh dude, I had like a very kind of a similar dream, but it was like in a different, um, it was kind of a different context. So I was going to go see a movie and I was on the fence about going and seeing it. It was a, that, and I don't even know why I was going to go see it because I'm a big like comic book fan. I grew up reading mm-hmm. comic books. And so I was going to, I was going to go see that Joker movie. Mm-hmm. And then I was like on the fence, about it. I'm like, oh, this looks like really dark. And it's just like, I don't know. And, and, um, and so I, had, I had gone to sleep just to take a nap and, in the dream, I was in the movie theater where my friend and I were talking about going to sing. It's a dinner theater. So like you were sitting around, you have tables and people come wait on you and it's great. And it was like, you know, the buzz of excitement for like a, a movie everybody's looking forward to, everybody's talking and everything. And sure. I look up in the corner just above the the screen because the movie hadn't started yet. And I see this dark cloud. And it's like small. It's not like maybe like, mm-hmm. you know, this big. Mm-hmm you know, three feet in diameter. And then it grows. And it's just like this black smoke cloud just grows. And all of a sudden I see this, like this smoke tentacle come down like this and it goes into somebody's mind. And then I all of a sudden I look around and I start seeing more smoke tentacles coming down into people's minds and into people like all over the place. Wow. And at the time I immediately woke up and I was like, cause it was like right That's before funny. the smoke tentacle touched me, I, I woke up cause I was like, no, I don't want, this is wrong. I need, this mm. is not, And the Lord was showing me in the spirit, like we need to be mindful of what types of things we're letting in. Like a movie is not just a movie. A TV show is not just a TV show. Music is not just a music. And, Mm -hmm. and there's so much of the spirit that we've labeled as ordinary that actually is a part of, and I think we'll realize that when we actually go to heaven, we're going to be like, oh my goodness. I can't believe I was so ignorant. I can't believe. Yeah. And yeah. so the Lord showed me, I immediately felt the fear of the Lord. And I was like, mm-hmm. I am not supposed to go see this movie. And I'm supposed to tell anybody that will listen, don't go see this movie mm-hmm. just because of what it done. And look, some people have seen it. Spiritful Christians have seen it. I know a couple who have yeah. and whatever, you know, I haven't seen it. I, I wanted to, and I, this, and I saw it was dark. I was like, no, but yeah. this is spot on. This is exactly what the, the tenant. I mean, that's a confirmation because I've never heard anyone else say the tentacle, but I know what right. I saw. Yeah. It, it was a tentacle and it's a spirit behind it. And so we do have to be really, really, really careful 